Have you heard of the blazing topic that's driving up home values? Yes. In states where recreational cannabis is legal, homeowners are reaping, whoops, I mean reaping huge benefits. The cannabis industry isn't just about good vibes. It's bringing in major revenue. By the end of 2023, total sales revenue was projected to hit $25 billion. With $1 billion per state of legalized recreational cannabis, tax revenues are soaring. California, leading the pack at $1.1 billion in 2022, was expected to reel in a staggering $4.9 billion by the end of 2023. States with medicinal cannabis are also seeing a property value surge. Since 2014, these states have experienced an average growth of $166,609, compared to $137,320 in states without medicinal cannabis. According to a study from 2022 and an article in BAM, today, a typical home in a recreational pot-friendly state is worth $417,625, which is 41% more or $122,287 more than the value of a typical home in a non-recreational state. Their typical value right now is $295,338. It's not just about dollars, it's about jobs too. The cannabis industry supports 428,000 American jobs, growing at least 27% per year since 2017. So which states are cashing in on cannabis? Recreational cannabis is legal in just under half of the states in the US. On this graph, the dark green states have legalized medicinal and recreational cannabis, while the lighter green states have only legalized medical. So it begs the question, is legalized cannabis worth it? I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments, especially if you live in one of the 24 states where cannabis has become recreationally legal. Is it great for more than just property values or is there a downside? And whether or not cannabis and its legalization is affecting your home values, there's lots of other ways that if you're looking to sell your house, you can improve the value of your property. I'm Lindsay Johnson, your resource for all things real estate. See you next time.